Hello, everybody. Hello, hello. Hi, Nanchan. Hi, Eva. Hi, Etern. Hi, Eric. How are you guys doing? I'm so sorry. I'm late. I was in the middle of a monster hunter hunt. <laughs> so I am here now. Hi. I recently played some time. Thank you. Uh, I'm not nyang. <laughs> I am not going to nya after a sentence. But guys, I just opened this game and it's it's already giving like these super creepy vibes. So I'm excited. How's everyone doing today? Are you guys having a good day? The wrong. No. No, I didn't. No, I didn't. It did say ending stream. Uh, I forgot to change it. That's okay. Uh, but it said starting soon at the end there. So don't worry about it. Pretend you saw nothing. Pretend you do not see, you know? Anyways, let's go. Mike went brrr. Wait, is Mike not working? Is Mike being bad? Ah, ah, ah. Sound test, sound test. Testing, one, two, three. Ba, 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 ba. No, yes, yes, no, no, yes. Good. Oh, it's for a sec. Okay, it's good now. Okay. Okay. Let's do this. Let me know how the volume is, guys. I'm going to pass out. Sleep. If you're tired, sleep. A little loud. A little quieter. Okay. All right, let's do this. Oh. New game. Let's go. Welcome, detective. Please make yourself comfortable. Can we be a little louder? A little louder. Yeah, yeah, yeah. A little louder. I'm gonna watch it. Okay, okay. If you're tired, though, please rest. Ethan. Yeah, music technician. All good. All good. I think this is appropriate volume. Just let me know if you guys can't hear me or the game is too loud. I appreciate your coming in today, and I'm sure you're wondering what this is all about. Okay, As you know, a little louder, a little louder. Technology is changing how we conduct investigations. So we're looking for exceptional candidates to test a new human computer interface system. New human we think you might have what system. it takes. So let's get started. Okay, okay. First of all, we'd like you to put on these headphones. But the room is equipped with speakers, <clears throat> if you'd prefer. Mm. Next, we're going to show you a series of pictures. Are there trigger warnings in this we game? Should I put trigger warnings up? Because I don't know. I haven't touched this before. What you hear. Go ahead and pick up the tablet in front of you. Okay, pick up the tablet. Smoke! Cigarette. Cigarette. Oh my god. Try to relax. Think of this as sort of a game or a puzzle. Puzzle. Something to assess your interpretive and deductive skills. Oh, this is a brainy game? Okay. My brain doesn't bra Oh my god, what? Click the play Oh quest Oh you guys don't okay hold on. Let me move myself to the other side. Hold on. Okay. All right, all right, all right. So, oop, too much, too much, too much. <laughs> okay, so there's a question here. It says, "Who hid the drugs?" So I guess we are gotta we gotta figure out who hid the drugs. Let's let's find out. Let's find out. All right, let me move myself down a little more. Okay, okay. State your name, please. I already told you, Tyler. Tyler. Okay, click this. Uh oh, click a sound source, then select the name you think matches the choice. Okay, Tyler. Mm -hmm. But your car is registered under the name Cameron. <coughs> My brother lets me borrow his luxury vehicle sometimes. You two look a lot alike. Can I say hello? It's a crime for me You're to not, not sleep yet. Go sleep! Hi, but please rest. Please rest. I thank you. Thank you so much for coming in to say hi, but please rest if you need to rest. Is there subtitles? I pulled your sheet. Hold on. Is there subtitles? No subtitles. Okay, no options. Subtitles. It's fine. Defender. DUI. Assault. DUI. Assault. It's the people I hang out with. Honest. I told the guys I shouldn't have been drinking, but they insisted. I swear, never again. Do you have anything else you'd like to come clean on besides the DUI? 
Uh, not that I can think of. Why? Drugs, Tyler perhaps. has a DUI. Does that jog your memory? Wait, what? I don't know anything about any drugs. Okay, we're done for now. Wait here. Hey, what drugs, yo? What the hell's going on here? Hi, welcome in. I can't see your name, <laughs> but welcome in. Welcome in, you. <laughs> Follow her to see what happens. Right click on the map to move. Okay. Oh, so that's our person. Okay, so we gotta follow her. Oh my god, okay. Well done, Marty. Ah, Amber. How'd it go? Asked him the basics. He said he didn't know anything. I figured as much. Follow me. I'll talk to him. Wait here. We'll need your signature for that affidavit. Of course, officer. That's Marty. That's Amber. That's... Is that Cameron? That's Cameron. Okay. So we can select... Different spaces contain different parts of the story. You should explore to find them. I'll head back to the interrogation room. Okay. Okay, okay. Officer, you said something about drugs earlier. What was that all about? What's your name, son? Tyler. Same old story, I see. If you're Tyler, then who's the Tyler in the room next door? He's here too? Let me ask you again. Ooh. Who are you? All right. All right. Cameron. That's Cameron. This isn't your first time impersonating Tyler, Wait. is it? No. If it was Wait, then who's this? Why this time you okay. might have been able to pull off your little stunt again. But seriously, drugs? You really want to pin that on your brother too? What mm. drugs? We found a whole kilo in your trunk. That's impossible! Okay, I drink too much, but I've never taken anything stronger than aspirin! Ah. I want to see my lawyer. Finally, there's the magic word. Amber, let's go. You want to question wow. if his lawyer gets here? Okay. He's done nothing but lie straight from the start. We already read him his rights, but he didn't ask for a lawyer until now. The statement we got will hold up in court. Lawyer or no lawyer, we've got him. You reach the end of the recording, click the button below to listen to it again. Remember, you might find more clues by following different characters or exploring other rooms. Ah, okay. So move here. And then press play. Is this Tyler? Thanks. The tips you provided us have all been checked out. We've got the guy and the drugs. There's just one thing I don't get. Why would you report your own brother? My mic peaked? Wait, why is my is my mic having issues right now? Hold on. What do you mean? Does it do it does it sound normal? Mike Bird okay, hold on, let me turn it on and off. Hold on. Ever since we were kids. But now he is rich and famous. And me? I'm drinking hard just to get by. Then why do you always take the fall for him? Until now, I mean. Because he's older, by a couple minutes. But as the second son, ah, ah, ah. testing spoiled brat. So it was my duty. Oh, so this is Tyler. The rightful heir to our father's business. I guess I always thought, what's the harm adding a few misdemeanors to my rap sheet? Pretty generous for a spoiled brat. Don't believe me? Ask him. Fuck. He's probably still pretending to be me. Oh, they're twins. What changed this time then? He racks up a couple moving. Knock, knock. Who is it? Door? Door who? Door who? Door is closed. Open, please. That's some felony level shit. Funny level Be shit. right back. All done, Marty. Ah, Amber. How'd it go? Asked him the basics. He said he didn't know anything. Figured as much. Follow me. I'll talk to him. Wait here. We'll need your signature for that affidavit. Of course, officer. I need to make a phone call anyway. So now Tyler's making a phone call. Okay. stunt as we speak <laughs> yeah i knew he'd try to blame me but it's gonna backfire on him this time 
Don't worry. He was already wasted when I popped open the car. Didn't notice a thing. The police are gonna nail him for possession and perjury. And when you finish this little errand, he won't even be able to... Oh, oops. ...for up the dealer as part of a plea. He's going to jail, and I'm getting the business. Wow! can't and won't help him this time. Not after Cameron got caught with what he did. You'll get your cut after I take over his heir. Anyway, no celebrating yet. Go do what you gotta do, and call me back when it's done. Ah, okay. If I listen, now I'm kind of interested. What if I go when? Come back! What? I don't know anything about any drugs. Okay, so Tyler hid the drugs in Cameron's car. What drugs, yo? What the hell's going on here? Come back here! What did you mean when you said? Oh, damn it! Okay, think, think. I paid my bar tab, went to the car. Definitely had too much to drink, but I don't remember there being anything wrong when I got there. Uh, I may have passed out for a couple minutes. Could somebody be trying to set me up? Maybe, but who? And why like this? Uh, just stick to the story. As if I had another one. Okay. Well, we know Tyler hit the drugs. We knew Tyler hit the drugs. So, oh man. Okay, that's messed up. Officer, you said something about drugs earlier. What was that all about? So who hit the drugs? Tyler hit the drugs. Submit. Do I think I discovered the truth? Yes! You found the truth! Close case! Oh my god. What the heck? Drugs, perhaps. Does that jog your memory? Wait, what? I don't know anything about any drugs. There's just one thing I don't get. Why would you report your own brother? Let me ask you again. Who are you? All right. All right. Cameron. We found a whole kilo in your trunk. A whole kilo. I guess uh, I guess I'm sorry. Oh my god, you turned you hit the drugs? Oh my god. Didn't notice a thing. Oh my god. That's interesting. Okay, so we're gonna be following like a bunch of different people doing different crimes. So you crimes. believe that the twins swapped their identities? Excellent assessment, detective. Mm -hmm. By this point, you've probably figured out you're reviewing a sort of surveillance recording. All of this data is contained in and processed by what we're calling the uh, acoustic detective system. Acoustic it allows detective you system. To freely navigate through past events using captured audio. Okay. Ultimately, we're hoping to assemble a new investigative department that will rely heavily on this invention, both to solve cold cases and assist with new ones as they develop. Made the name on the you spot. Yeah, it was a kind story. of like a but very direct. Maybe I mean, sometimes they just want direct names. More challenging. Is my mic? Ah, why is my mic being so weird? Okay, one second. Let me do one more thing. Ah, uh, ah. Uh, uh. Uh, let me reset my audio engine. That might be the issue. Uh, 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 okay. All right. If it still has issues, I might have to restart my PC. But let's let's. Uh, does it sound better now? Ah, uh, uh, uh. hello. Oh, new thing. Oh my god, the name's so the creepy. Of a local <laughs> the exhibition is about to start, but the only thing on display is an empty frame. Exhibition, okay. Oh my god, that is so creepy. Creepy transition. Alright, let's play this. What has more voice? Okay, let's play this first. Let's play this person's voice first. Mr. Green, what brings you here? Okay, so this is green. I wanted to thank you in person for uh, sending me a photo of the maestro's painting. 
Thanks to that high quality image, I could see all the fine details and woo wee talk about so I mean, yeah, there's a, a lot of names. <laughs> Please keep your voice down. I sent it to you because you've been a good sponsor to this gallery, and I hope that will continue. But we're under strict orders not to show that painting to anyone. The threat of forgery. I thought that was my phone. Oh my up. god. Ah, whatever. Ah, good luck to anyone who thinks they could copy the maestro's genius. <laughs> Still, there are those out there. Wait, was that actually the recording? Oh yeah, it is. Yeah, it is. Okay, okay. Call center. <laughs> Sean, buddy, calm down. Oh, good morning, Ivory. Oh, hi, out. Welcome in. You know, Enjoy I your breakfast. Left originals, the best of the best, right? I wanted to see it before the opening. It's not a so like real, right? So I'm gonna buy it. Actually, about that, I well, I'm afraid that maybe you should just. Answer that. Hmm? Go ahead. Oh my god, who's Wonky's <laughs> ringing? Like In the I middle said, of a meeting? Swung by to say thanks for the sneak preview. You've probably got a pack schedule. I'll see you iPhone. Yeah, it's the iPhone ringtone. Mm. Wait, what was this person's name? Actually, about that, I. Well, I'm afraid that. Maybe you should just answer that. Hmm? Go ahead. Right then, like I said, just swung by to say thanks for the sneak preview. You've probably got a packed schedule. I'll see you out there. Does this guy say anything more? Sean! So that's Sean. Uh, Maestro, there you are. I was just looking for you. And this is I Maestro? I your painting the other day, by the okay. way. Truly okay. Truly a masterpiece. But when I just went to check on it earlier, all I saw... Using my ringtone? Oh, thank you, Najan. Thank you. Pick up! Pick up your phone! <laughs> Could I ask the reason, if you don't mind? <sighs> Do you know why I picked the theme, the lost art, for this exhibition? The lost art. Look outside. Look at all those people staring at an empty frame. Thinking it is my actual work. Tell me, Sean, just how many works of art from young, promising artists do you have in this gallery right now? Ten? Twenty? You might as well have zero for all it is worth to these people. To them, this empty, pointless frame is more valuable than the actual art of all of these rising artists. It's empty frame? It's just an empty frame? Oh my god. Nowadays have any taste. Even like if everyone's voice out, that'd be insane. You're not wrong. Bang there, bang sound the feature. Oh, you think there's gonna be a shooting? Maybe. That's pretty much how it's always been. You are right. Of course. The Renaissance elite, uh, they patronized the starving sculptors and painters. But it feels especially true now. That art has become about who has more money, whose name is more recognized. People have become. That's true. That is what art has become now no these days. Opinions of their own. Call it performance art, if you wish. But this exhibition was never about a piece of canvas. No, the truth is, I hired a thief and instructed him to steal my painting and to sell it on the black market. Oh. If someone eventually recognizes my work, I will reveal everything, my entire scheme. Oh. And sign my name to it. Why, that's, that's brilliant. Just imagine the rush of people who will be out searching for your painting. While it's true that they may just be in it for the money, They'll have to go through hundreds and hundreds of anonymous paintings if they have any hope of. That's interesting. Green, yeah, Green's probably having a really good phone call. This is Claude. <laughs> Thank you. Magnet I was like, that's a really, that's a really cool, yeah, to be an artist. Begin. Are you ready, Maestro? Yes. Let us, uh, as they say. Get this show on the road, huh? Mm. I am hopeful that after today, 
people will finally start to appreciate the art around them. Mm. As they search for the stolen painting, they will find much more than they bargained for. The true lost art. Ah. Is found, this exhibition will continue. A brilliant plan. What once was lost shall be found, as they say. Precisely. Yes, yes, it's about that time. Shall we go? Onward and upward. Let us march. After you. Ah, there you are, Maestro. The exhibition's about to start. Mais oui. Ladies, Ladies and, gentlemen, and gentlemen, welcome, welcome, welcome. welcome. I'm, so I'm so glad, glad you could all be here today. today. I'm, I'm sure, sure many of you have questions, questions about, about the, well, well empty, empty frame, frame you see before you, before you which, is which is why, why without, without further, further ado, ado, I'd like I'd to like officially to announce the commencement the of the Lost Art exhibition. exhibition. Put, your Put your hands together, together for the maestro, maestro Claude. Mmm, okay. Thank you. Yay! Maestro! Thank you. Okay. My warmest of welcomes to all of you here to see my work. This piece... Hi, Seiko. Welcome in. This piece has been an entire year in the making. However, it would seem a year is still not enough. No doubt you have already noticed uh, the empty frame before you. I am sorry to tell you, but my painting has actually been stolen. Silence! I, I have no doubt it will end up on the black market. Where are you going? Merci. I uh, forgot something I gotta take care of. Got a split? Thanks for visiting. Not taking any photos of it. In fact, any anonymous painting out there on the market could, in fact, be my work. I hope that one day you will seek out the truth using only your eyes and, of course, your heart. And nothing else to find my painting. To? Director, the painting's been found! But what? Another way? Is it cannot be? What? what? The, uh, the lost art has returned! It's a miracle! Oh my god, what the heck is going on? Alright, I was interested in what happened here. Now I want to see what's going on here. So in the outside, there was a lot of people outside. My show goes my show starts here. Someone there were there was someone outside, no? Okay, let's listen to these guys. Who is this person? Is there anyone in this room? Good news. I have a potential buyer. Okay. Good news. I have a potential buyer. One I don't expect will require much convincing or ask too many questions. Quit worrying. It's perfectly safe. You know I don't deal with the real thing, ever. But the others are none the wiser, and my position gives me plausibility. So long as you keep your mouth shut, everything will be fine. Besides, I have completed oh, so she is... your skill. There isn't a single person who'll be able to tell your work is a fake. Okay, so she anyway, is this was all his idea. Selling a copy. This performance art the maestro orchestrated as his assistant. I'd like to think I'm doing him. But so this is the maestro's assistant. And since he staged this whole thing himself, he won't get the police involved. That should put your mind at ease. Ah. I've already told you, the lost art. It's about more than just the theft and retrieval of a painting. Who knows how many people are going to get tangled up in this before it's over, each of them playing their own special roles in the maestro's machinations without realizing it. You and I, well, we're just the first two actors in the play, but at least oh. improvising. Really. The more I think about it, there's a lot going the on. This is gonna be seven minutes in different is. rooms. That's Thor crazy. Truly is a master. Anyway, I should hey, wait. go. I mean, I want to hear what Green is talking about on the Yo. phone call. Let's see. 
slapping. When green comes out of the room, it's gonna be like right now. Mac, simmer down. I need to check things out first. This kind of research can't be rushed. Call me back in a few minutes. Mac. Ms. Reeves. Didn't you come to see the opening? Amy? So this is Miss Reeves. On my way. See you soon. So, are the rumors true? I hear the maestro hired someone to swipe his work so he could showcase an empty frame. Only he would pull something like that. <laughs> now, I want to hear something else. I want to hear what was going on in the maestro's room here earlier. Let's hear from the beginning. Everyone's on a phone call. Everybody's on a phone call. Wait, so this must be security out here. That, that must be security. Then someone comes in. At this point. Uh, excuse me. Is this the uh, toss art exhibition? It's the lost art. That's a man of tomorrow. But enough, he said, she said. Which way do I go to get to the storeroom? The storeroom? Well, it's over across from the bathrooms. But Listen, okay, no easy turn. Eat well. Sleep well, sorry. Eat well. Sleep well. Thanks, man. That's security. On my way. See you soon. And then who is this? Hey, he's gonna look at some paintings, I think. We gotta figure out who everybody is. He looks out the the window. Oh, there's someone in here. Wait, what the heck? Who is this? Why are they walking around like that? Damn it. This storeroom looks like a fucking hurricane ran through it. How the hell am I supposed to find the safe? Yeah, well, who's the guy in the bathroom? I've been waiting. Oh, this must be Mac. Talking to Mr. Green. I swapped it with the real one in the storeroom. Wasn't that our plan all along? Dude, deal's off. Forget about the rest of your money. Someone beat me to it? Why don't I miss that? Wait, what? Hi, Kenya. Welcome in. Hello? Hello? What the hell? Someone beat me to it? So this guy is Why Mac, I, I think. That? Okay, and then we got this guy here. <laughs> and just like that, the job's done. Too easy. No wonder the old man ain't paying me much. Could have had me swipe a nicer painting, too. People these days will call anything art. This guy must be Tommy then, right? Yo, old man! I got the merchandise! Wait, what? And what about the rest of my money, huh? Hello? Hello? God damn it! Yeah, not the peeing noises. What the heck? Hey, you don't happen to have a light on you, do you? Hmm? What's that you got there? What? Hey, this is... Is that a copy of the Maestro's painting? I got one myself. Pretty good, huh? Uh, yeah. Uh, yes, of course. <sighs> Want a cigarette? 
Don't know about you, but I'm barely keeping it together. Before the 90s, you could smoke anywhere, but now? <laughs> sure, thanks. Don't mind if I do. So they're just smoking in the bathroom now? Okay. <laughs> I can finally think again. I swear they put restrictions on everything these days. Corral us out in the freezing cold in a designated smoker's area 15 feet from the door. Like nobody ever took a drag in front of the Mona Lisa before they put it behind glass. You feel me? Uh, sure, yeah, I feel ya. Goddamn rules. Oh yeah, is that a play PFP? I noticed that. No oh my god. Oh ah. shit. Fucking smoke detector in the bathroom. Put it out, man. Put it out. Ouch. Watch it, man. Uh, so sorry. <laughs> sorry, I, I panicked. Anyway, it was uh, nice talking to you. Here's your pick. Oh, he's... See you around, yeah? Oh, oh, he, swap he swapped them. I have no doubt you will end up on the black market. Where are you going? I, uh, uh forgot something I gotta take care of. You gotta split. Thanks for visiting. No, no, I think any auto. Stop! Where'd you get that? You weren't holding it when you came in! I... Uh... Bought it from the gift shop? Oh, well... Wait, we don't have a gift shop! What the You stole it! Hand it over! Jesus, fine, take it! It ain't worth a shit anyway! Director! The painting's been found! Oh my god! Another way! It cannot be! Okay... This is very... This is very comical. Okay, so Mac got it. Wait, there's three? Okay. Now we gotta listen to what they said in here. Don't know a thing about it until. Don't you agree? I hear the maestro hired someone to okay. swipe his what for helping me find it. It's my pleasure, but don't bother looking for it on the black market. That place is nothing but a cesspool of forgeries. What do you mean by that? The maestro may have his own plan, but if the painting's going to get stolen anyway, I figured I could do him a favor. Ta -da. Wait. The, uh, okay. 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 I think I want to say Reeves has a fake one because she was talking to someone on the phone about forgeries. Tommy stole the real one. Wait. Oh, yeah. Tommy stole the real one. Maestro was the one who hired Tommy to steal it. Mac took the real one. For oh, my God. This is complicated. Wait. Took it? When, uh... Okay, wait. Let me think about this. Uh... Oh, this is rough. A lot of brainy going on. Okay. When did you nab it? The when is unimportant. What matters is that I have it. If you'll uh, excuse me for a moment, I have to take this. Hopefully if Reese talks about it now and we'll find out. No, she doesn't. Painting behind Hmm. Key in my head. I'll quit worrying. Okay. That's what she said at the beginning. Good news. I have a potential buyer. One I don't expect will require much convincing. Or ask too many questions. Quit worrying. It's perfectly safe. You never deal with the real thing. Ever. But the others are none the wiser. But the other thing. 
ever. Not that will work. Wait, you know I never deal with the real thing. Don't worrying. Said. It's perfectly safe. You know I don't deal with the real thing. Okay. Ever. All right. Okay. 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 But the others are none the wiser. I have and all the clues I need. Okay. So, who stole the real painting first? Ami. Who has real painting in the end? Mac. Yes. Wait, what? All the names are correctly. You need to answer all two questions. Right now, none of them are correct. What? Okay, I got them wrong. Okay. So in that case... Okay, let's listen to what Mac has to say in the beginning. Did... Funny. Hello? Hung up on me again? Waiting. Oh, wait. Okay. Mac must have stole it first because he's hiding here. He swapped it. Okay, so it means that security has the real one. And Mac stole the real painting first. Ah, there we go. Okay, okay, okay. Got it. Got it. We're so smart. Me. I'm so smart. Good news. I have a potential buyer. Worrying. It's perfectly safe. You know I don't do the real thing. Ever. Interesting. It's like a detective game. You took it? You, you, when, uh, when did you nab it? The win is unimportant. What matters is that I have it. I checked. It's a fake. I feel like an idiot for spending all that cash to hide that decent fortune. What are you talking about? Of course the painting you gave me is fake, but I swapped it with the real one. Oh, I missed. Oh. Turns out that one's fake too. The deal's off. Forget about the rest of Ah, okay, I get it. Hi, Light Samuel. Welcome in. Hello. I understand. Okay, so I missed that one part where Green was like, it's okay. To the storm. Is it come off as a save? Is cool your chats, old man. You told me once before. I'm not gonna forget it. Yo, old man. I got the merchandise. Ouch! Watch it, man. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> Sorry, I, I panicked. Yeah, anyway, it was uh, nice talking to you. Here's your painting. See you around, yeah? You stole it! Hand it over! Jesus, ah. I it. it ain't worth a shit anyway. Okay. Good work. Looks like you're getting the hang of this. Mm-hmm. I am. Before we go any further, I should inform you our acoustic detective system does have potential side effects. Potential side effects. For example, you may start hearing voices as the test continues. Oh god, we're gonna be schizophrenic. She's so close to us now. There's nothing to worry about, I can assure you. Why is she so close? When the exam is finished, depending on the outcome, we'll provide any additional treatment you might need. Now on to the next scenario. To further test your abilities, we'll try a higher profile case. One I'm sure you remember from the news. Higher profile case? Murder! Murder! The bombing I'm gonna get, like, occurred last year bombing. at the central booking complex downtown. A gruesome tragedy in a crowded police station. Bombing. Twelve people, twelve victims. Ooh. Now, what's your take on this? Oh god, oh god, okay. Okay. Dwight, Jessica, Kent, Schreider. Mickey, Chip, Martin, Blade, Tucker. Blade? Doug, Tucker, Cassie, Sting. Okay. Go to the area with the most people. No one in here. No one in here. Oh, one person in there. Uh, Bathrooms. No one in there. No one in there. Who brought the bomb? Who detonated the bomb? And who is Raven? Okay. Okay. All right, let's go talk to these two people first. Anyone outside? No one outside. Okay. 
Hello, Sergeant. May I please have my phones back? Name? Dwight. Yeah, let me check here. Theft case, huh? Dwight. Uh, no can do. Your phone's evidence in an ongoing case. So, uh, you'll have to follow procedure. Let me think. Thank you, Zion. Thank you. I feel so All bonita. Right. What do I need to do? Who told you to come here? Ask them to write you a release form. An officer named Jessica. I need to go back to her. Officer Schrader. You working the night shift tonight? Officer Schrader. <laughs> what a surprise. <sighs> I don't even have to this bust you. Ridiculous. You still end up here. What do you do this time? You wound me. I'm nothing if not a law-abiding citizen. Just picking up a pal like a good friend. Well, hey there, Captain Martin. What are you doing here? Captain Got Martin. Something to take care of us all? Well, I'll be. Blade? And Doug? How's life treating you guys? Shut it, you dumb fuck. Don't That's Blade. You, know you two, phones, wallets, and whatever you have in your pockets on the desk. And this must be Doug. Schrader. We had a small fender bender. They're accompanying me so we can sort out the details. Wait, who's this? Hi, Officer Schrader. You don't think you could ask around and see when Chip's gonna get released for me, do you? Oh, so you own the place now, do you? Find out yourself. Mickey, glad to see you. Officer, nice That's to meet Mickey. you. Name's Mickey, Mickey Ocean. I'll take care of the paperwork, Schrader. Give this patient gentleman his phone. Yeah, now beat it. That's I Jessica. Two of these. There should be another one. Two phones? You think you're Daddy Warbucks? By the way, could you tell me where the bathroom is? Inside, until you left. Good evening, officer. So sorry for the oh, trouble. My I want to follow Dwight. Let's follow Dwight for a second. Actually, wait. Can who is this guy? Was it? Did you bring money for his fine? That I did. Right here. I need your signature. And try to keep your buddy on a tighter leash. Thanks, Emil. I'll see you around. Keep up the great work. Rookie. That's Chip. That's Chip. <laughs> Tucker Cassidy. Burning the midnight oil, I see. Tucker wow. Cassidy. Who do we have here? Oh, shut up. I, uh, never mind. Who the hell's calling me at this time of night? Cassidy, I'm gonna take our friend here to the interrogation room. I've got to answer this. On it. You, phone, wallet, everything in your pockets on the desk. Here's my phone. You oh. had me down too. Tucker handled that already. Just let him in. You'll get him back when you leave. For brains. How many times I gotta tell ya? You... First. Word on the street is... So everyone stay vigilant. Raven? I don't Who's know this? all the info, but I'll fill you in once I have more. Hey, wait, who is this? Oh, that's Dwight. Do I say anything when you get into the bathroom? Oh, I can't hear him because that. Oh, no, that is. Well, breathe in! Well, would you look who's awake? Quiet in there! Hey, come on, let me out. What are you in for, huh? Let's see. Public intoxication. Beautiful. Why'd they even bother? Ah, uh, shove it already. Just open the gate. Let's try to limit our alcohol next time, maybe. I didn't even have that much. How come I passed out? Somebody slipped something in my drink. I still feel groggy. Yeah, yeah, I've seen plenty of guys like you, all claiming they didn't drink that much. He didn't drink that Oh! Oh my god. That sound of the gate was so loud. Oh, that scared me. Oh my god. Legs a bit heavier than I remember. See? More proof that you shouldn't drink in your condition. This way. Let's get you released. You know, for a fact, my test came back clean as a whistle. Yeah, yeah. That's got to be. Drunk or not, you still hit it. Why are you here? Why are you here? Oh! Oh my god, okay. Oh my god, okay. Oh my god, okay. Holy shit, okay. All right. Oh my god, okay. Alright, hold on. <sighs> Are you done? It was just a phone! Guy didn't even want to press charges! But you brought me in anyway just to hit me with some outrageous fine for petty theft! You broke the law! What? 
Doesn't surprise me that you're a rookie. No one else about it. Hi, Kazia. Welcome in. On night patrol. You're wasting everybody's time. I've had just about enough of you. Thankfully, you won't be my problem much longer. Somebody paid your ticket. I'm in no hurry. Though, can't say the same for the guy whose phone I pinched. He looked like a real complainer. Excuse me, officer. Sorry to have to bother you again. Come on in. Well, speak of the devil. Ah, uh, the desk sergeant wants a release form. Can you help? I'd really appreciate my things back. No problem. I'm almost done. You're lucky you aren't being booked. But you still gotta fill this out. No! For crying out loud, it's not like I went on a killing spree. There! Ta -da. I was on her. Very interesting game. game. Very interesting now. game. Mm -mm. Lots of stuff happening. Let's go listen to Martin, Blade, and Doug. Oh, that means... Wait, who's Kint? It was just a car accident, Captain. Did that really require bringing us all the way in like this? I got somewhere I need to be. Yeah, are you picking on Doug? Quiet, both of you. I'm doing this by the book. And now that we're back at the station, I'm going to make you take another breathalyzer. We blew at the scene and it came back negative. What more do you want? You gonna let us go or not? Congratulations, loudmouth. You're up first. Follow me. You, stay right here. Okay, something's gonna happen with Doug, I bet. No? Okay, I guess not. When is this gonna be over? I ain't got all day. Was he calling? Go in there and stall him for as long as you can. Conference room? Why? What did he do? Car accident. Fake car accident. Only it didn't seem so fake to him. And I need you to keep it that way. Do whatever you need to do. Just don't you let him first. leave. Okay, who's this? Who's this? Who's this person? Tucker gave the order earlier today. He didn't explain anything, and I had no... What are you guys trying to pull, huh? I mean... Okay, let's listen to this. Let's listen to this interrogation here. It's just you and me now, Sting. What are you guys Sting. trying to pull, huh? I mean, setting up roadblocks... That means this guy, last guy, is Kint. No okay. Tucker gave the order earlier today. He didn't explain anything, and I had no idea he was trying to catch you. What's this Tucker up to? Now that you mention it, Tucker has been acting strange lately. Before he brought you in, he was up at the Mountain Hotel, picked up a drunk. Okay, now I want to see what this is going up. What's going on here? Here. That idiot Blade hit a cop car. That Ooh. Is that Dwight calling him? Hit it. Uh, oh, fuck. I'm in lock up. Lock up. What's this? Okay. Where is this place? Huh? Oh fuck! I'm in lockup. Damn! I'm in lockup. The phone call. The customer you're trying to reach is not available. Please call back. Hello? Anybody here? Anybody still breathing? Well, would you look who's awake? Yeah, what's going on here? Saw an opportunity. So I had him booked for public intoxication. No shit. Like that old fox. <laughs> here. Okay, hold on, hold on, hold on. Let's hear this, let's hear this. Hi, okay, thank you, Nacha. I'll hide you right now. Fucker and Doug. Take a seat, please. Now, what the fuck are you doing here? That idiot Blade hit a cop car, and that buffoon Martin arrested us. He's just trying to give us a hard time. Martin's always been trouble. You think he heard something? Not that it matters. I've got everything under control. Picked up Sting and Kent to clear the way for you to take over. Who'd have thought, huh? All three of us in the same police station. Those two behave. Sting didn't even try to run. Sounds just like that old fox. Kent? Kent, he... He couldn't run, even if he wanted to. What do you mean by that? I went to the Mountain Hotel earlier to case the place and found Kent in a VIP room. Sucker was already three sheets to the wind. 
Saw an opportunity. So I had him booked for public intoxication. No shit. Huh. Ah. Why did you get there so early? You think the boss told him before the rest of us? I didn't see anyone else there. What's your boss look like? <laughs> nice try. Only us three have ever seen our boss in the flesh. He likes to keep a low profile, you know. I wasn't trying to trick you. Just and now I want to see. Now I, now I want to see what this is. What this is. What did Dwight say the tonight as he was leaving? Enough. Oops. Sorry uh, about that. It's fine. You just stole that guy's phone. That was something else. Something else. I'll show you something else. Look at me, Chip, and tell me what's a phone to you, huh? This phone ain't worth squat if you're gonna just sell it. It's the mobile era now. A phone's more than just a phone, it's access. Access to the owner's... Ah, never mind. You're too stupid to understand all that. What did I tell you, huh? There's my Damn, money! Damn, Mickey, you the man! I'm learning all sorts of new techniques tonight. Go on, then. Give it a try. Hello, officer. Have you seen my phone? Oh, you again? That's gotta be a record! Yeah, I... Just dial it. Give it a try! Oh, okay. We got a phone right here. I've got this! Huh. Weird. He's only got one number saved. Who cares? Just dial it. Ah, okay. Okay, 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 okay. Okay, 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 okay. Dwight brought the bomb. Chip is the one who detonated it. Now we gotta figure out who... Who Raven is. Okay. So let's go over to here where they talk to Sting. Reminds me of the map of Harry Potter. Brought you in, it's a very interesting thing. Uh, I mean, acting strange lately. Before he brought you in, he was up at the map. It's a very hotel, interesting game. I don't This map is like supposed holding. to be a police station or something. After he pulled. What are the odds? What's that drunk look like? Like any other dirty drunk. Had himself a good limp, though. His leg, was it prosthetic? And uh, did he have a scar on his right eye? And how do you know all that? You know the guy? Interesting. Doug's behind this, no question. Doug? Why's that? Earlier today, our boss informed us he was going to choose his successor. Only me, Doug, and Kent have a shot, really. Ah. Uh -huh. Doug asked Tucker to lock me and Kent up. It's so obvious. He wants to make sure he's the only candidate. Damn, you're telling me that drunk was an underboss? He took a bullet for the boss. That's how he lost his leg. Ah. That prosthetic leg of his? Hey, what's going on here? Even if he claims it's to pass on the Empire to one of his lieutenants. Psycho looks like everything you've heard about him is true. All right, I've sent someone in to stall Doug. Now tell me what you know. But make it quick. That car accident you staged won't buy us much time. Ooh, okay. Doug was already getting suspicious. Okay, how much do you know about Raven? I've heard all sorts of things. Some of them are so Hollywood blockbuster, I'm not sure what to believe anymore. I've been undercover as part of his organization for two years. Everything you've heard about him is true. After he pulls off a major heist, he wipes out his crew and gets a new identity. Oh. Remember that cargo freighter, the one that blew up in the harbor? Raven's doing. Got what he wanted, murdered his guys, and scuttled the ship with a remotely detonated explosive. All the info we've gathered on him suggests he eventually kills anyone who's seen his face. That explains why I can't find a single person who knows what this psycho looks like. Ah, okay. To tell you the truth, I wouldn't be able to positively ID Raven if he was standing right in front of me. But if this precious pattern of his means anything, we might have a chance of nabbing him tonight. He's made himself nothing short of a fortune running the rackets in this city the past few years. So when he calls a meeting with all of his associates up at the Mountain Hotel, I'm guessing he's looking to tie up loose ends. Even if he claims it's to pass on the Empire to one of his lieutenants. No. You the key. Not quite a limit. Okay, what's these guys? What are these guys? Patience, my friend. Patience. We'll have any? A dirty cop took my wallet. Otherwise, I wouldn't be here talking to you, no? Raining cats and dogs outside. Let me call us a cab. Just a sec. These guys are normal, I think. Minutes. Now, you're gonna tell me what's going on? I was at the Mountain Hotel when I saw that chump hanging outside. Stole the phone right out of his pocket. 
Didn't realize that lady cop was standing there watching me the entire time. Ow! Oh, shit for brains. How many times I gotta tell you? You can't make banks stealing phones. Dwight is Raven and Dwight brought the bomb. Wait. No, that wasn't make sense. Hold on, let's see, let's see. Dwight is Raven. Chip detonated the bomb. Is that right? Two are the correct answers, so... We don't know who brought the bomb. Okay, okay, let's see this again. Hello, Sergeant. May I please have my phones back? <sighs> are you done? It was just a phone! Hi, Sin, welcome in. Okay. Who do we... Excuse me, officer. Sorry to have to bother you again. Come on. Was all? Well, I'll be. Blade? And Doug? How's like... I'd really appreciate... Okay, wait, hold on. We have to... We have to see, then. We're back at the station. Tucker, it's me. I'm at your place. Where are you? Get that way. Do whatever you need to do, Jim. Let's know what Tucker's saying. No, we should talk now. I'll come find you. Wait, so who brought the bomb? Hi, Lin Hua. Welcome in. Fill you in once I have more. Yeah, we gotta listen to this conversation one more time then. Take a seat, please. Now, what the fuck are you doing here? That idiot Blade hit a cop car, and that buffoon Martin arrested us. He, all three of us in the same Look intoxication. No shit. Huh. Why well, can't get there so early? You think the boss told him before the rest of us? Yeah, but something's off. I've seen Kent drink for years, yet I've never seen him drunk. Not even once. Looks pretty sauce to me. Didn't even wake up on the ride over. Must have had himself a whole bottle. Or five. Yeah, well, this guessing game won't get us anywhere. You keep an eye on those two there, will you? We can't let anything go wrong now. I'm gonna go see the boss. Okay, I'll see you out. For a fact, my test came back clean as a whistle. There. Any one of them could be him. If we okay. sweep up the whole group, we can sort them when we book him. I guess we'll see. Okay, you head up there with Doug. I'll put together a squad to back you up. Got it. Now let's make this real. Fucking cops! You ain't got shit on me. DUI. For a f came back clean as a whistle. Hey, what's this? Hold on. Yeah, come on. But what am I gonna tell Tucker? Of money, he runs off and gets himself a new identity. No one even knows what he looks like. Holy shit! That's cold, man! Don't tell me you're Raven! If I was him, you'd be the first to go. <laughs> Just cut this bullshit and get me out of here. Come on! But what am I gonna tell Tucker? Yeah, let me worry about him. Let's go. Okay, wait. Hold on. Officer, have you seen my phone? Does this guy say anything the entire time? Or is he just quiet the entire time? Why are you here? I'll let everything in your pockets on the desk. I need your seat. Mick, you don't think. And... Well, hey there, oh, uh, everyone here blew up, so. We don't know yourself. who, uh. Well, I'll be. Like... Ah, Apollo! Welcome, welcome, welcome. Hello, Raiders. Welcome in. My name is Xander. I am a vampire singing e boy VTuber, and we are playing Unheard, which is a detective audio something game. <laughs> I'm not exactly sure how to describe it, but it's like we listen to stuff by audio, audio and we try to figure out what the uh, what the case is and what what's causing issues. Hello, am I winning? I am doing my best to win. It's a very interesting game. <laughs> welcome, Raiders. Welcome, welcome. What did you stream, Apollo? Did you have a good stream? I hope you had a good stream. What were you up to, huh? What were you up to? Okay. And Doug, how's life treating you guys? Shut it, you dumb fuck. Don't act like you know me. You two, phones, wallets, and whatever you have in. Officer, nice to meet you. Name's Mickey, Mickey Ocean. I'll take care of the paperwork, Schrader. Give this patient gentleman his phone. Yeah, now beat it. I lost two of these. There should be another one. Two phones? You think you're daddy, Warbucks? By the way, could you tell me where the bathroom is? Inside, to your left. Good evening, officer. So. Wait. Let's see, we want to really Let's go! Okay. 
long as you can. Come from him? Why? What did he do? Hello, some guy from Brazil. <laughs> Hello, e boy VTuber. Wait, I'm trying to figure out what's going on then. What happened? What happened here? Who? Who, who is the one? What? Okay. Vincent. All right, I want you to tell me everything. I'll send someone to keep Doug busy. Hitting a police car? Did it ever occur to you that it might blow your cover? I had to act fast. The info I've got is crucial for my investigation. Raven's going to show up tonight. What? All right, I want you to tell me everything. Raven's going to show up tonight. I'll send someone to keep... On it. You, phone, wallet, everything in your pocket. Conference room. Go in there and stall him for as long as you can. Conference room? What? Wait, so who planted the... Who... Is there, yes, there's a lot of voice acting in this. We're trying to figure out who planted the bomb. Who brought the bomb? Jess, there's a man in the conference room. Go in there and stall him for as long as you can. Conference room? So every... Uh -uh. Hey, babe, you knew. Jess. I'll hey, babe, you knew. But Captain Martin told me... Like I said, I'll take it from here. Hmm, understood. Talk in my office. Well, who planted the bomb? I'm sorry to know that. Okay, no worries, Lihua. Thank you for being here. Take, have a good practice. What are you doing here? Is not available. Sure, I'll bet you. Right over. Must have had himself a whole bottle. Or five. Hi, I'm yeah, girl. Welcome well, in. This guessing game won't get us anywhere. You keep an eye on those two there, Okay, will okay. We can't let anything go wrong now. I'm gonna go see the boss. Okay. I'll see you out. They're all leaving now. For a fact, my test came back clean as a whip. Oh, and they all... Again? That's gotta be a record. Why are yeah, you here? Why are you here? And then... So they all blow up there. Everyone blows up here, so we have to figure out who... Hey, buddy. Oh, come on, it's me. Don't tell me you don't recognize your old pal. Uh, yeah, yeah. Anyways, you gotta help me out. I'm in a real bind. Got arrested. Solicitation, yeah. Long story short, was on a business trip and got a little antsy. You know the feel. Uh, keep this between us, though, will ya? I called because you're the only one I can trust. You've got watching Doctor Who. Okay, enjoy your Doctor Who. Asking me for a grand to make this whole thing go away, else I'll be processed first thing in the morning. My own money? Think I have any? A dirty cop took my wallet. Otherwise, I wouldn't be here talking to you, now would I? Anyway, you need to wire the money to my friend's bank account. One six five nine eight. Seven two six two six. Name's Mickey. Ocean. Yeah, I like the sea. Uh, you'll be doing me a real solid, a real solid, and I'll pay you right back as soon as I get out. Thirteen hundred big smackolas. The extra three hundreds for your trouble. Uh, nah, nah, don't mention it. Friendship's worth its weight in gold nowadays. Uh, anyway, Wait, who's he talking back. to? Catch you later. You really think it'll work, Mickey? He totally bought it. Patience, my friend. Patience. We'll get the money soon enough. Oops. Sorry about that. Hey, wait. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Hold on. When he's calling... Okay, hold on. I saw that chump hanging outside. Shit for brains. How many times I gotta tell you? You can't make banks stealing okay. phones. Well, I just thought... You know... Practice makes perfect. Unbelievable. You really are a moron. Ugh, whatever. Look here. I'm gonna show you something. See? This here's a phone I stole on the bus. I don't get it. You call me stupid for stealing flip phones, and then you steal one yourself. <laughs> that piece of shit probably ain't even worth ten bucks. Wait and see, my friend. Wait and see. Okay, hey, when he hey, dials. Oh, come on, it's me. When he dials, whose phone is ringing? And then you okay. steal one yourself. He's gonna dial now. Is it Dwight's phone or Vince's phone? Neither. No one's phone? Okay. 
neither of their phones? Yeah. Long story short, was on a. I'm so confused. You've got to help me. You're here talking to you, now would I? Anyway, to see. Uh, you'll be doing me. Now, nah, don't mention it. Friendship's worth its weight in gold nowadays. It's... We'll get the money soon enough. Oops. Ugh. Sorry about that. It's fine. How many times I gotta tell ya? Who planted the bomb? Okay, I'm gonna say Tucker. I'm gonna say Tucker. I say I say Tucker because I think Tucker has... He's the one. He's the dirty cop here. And he's also the one who has access to the thing. No! Shit. Who would have planted the bomb? Mmm, this is hard. Hello, Sergeant. May I please have my phones back? Who's, oh, that's Dwight. Dwight. <laughs> Don't tell the person you think of is that person is uh, Dwight. You can do. Your phone's evidence in an ongoing case. So, uh, you... Is he snoring? Excuse me, officer. Sorry to have to bother you again. Come on in. Well, speak of the devil. Uh, the desk sergeant wants a release form. Can you help? I'd really appreciate my things back. No problem. I'm almost done. You're lucky you aren't being booked. I'm so confused. He's going to the bathroom. But who planted the bomb? I ain't gone all day. Tucker, it's me. I'm at your place. Something? Not that it matters. I've got everything under control. Does Jessica say anything throughout this whole thing? What are you limit up? Let him car keep it that way. Do whatever you need to do, just don't you let him leave. Roger that. Word on the street is Raven's in town. So everyone stay vigilant. Raven? I don't have all the info, but I'll fill you in once I have more. I'm kinda can okay, I kinda feel like there's something going on with Cassie here too. It's just you and me now, Sting. What are you guys trying to pull, huh? I mean, setting up roadblocks and arresting people for no good reason. Tucker gave the order earlier today. He didn't explain anything, and I had no idea he was trying to catch you. What's this Tucker up to? Now that you mention it, Tucker has been acting strange lately. Before he brought you in, he was up at the Mountain Hotel. Picked up a drunk. Guy's still lying and holding. Mountain Hotel? What are the odds? What's that drunk look like? Like any other dirty drunk. Had himself a good limp, though. His leg, was it prosthetic? And uh, did he have a scar on his right eye? And how do you know all that? You know the I'm guy? I'm so confused. Hold on. Hey, what do they say when they first get in here? Hold on. Call him for as long as you can. Be down too. Tucker handled that already. Just let him in. You get him back when you leave. Hang in your pockets on the desk. Here's my phone. You gotta pat me down too. Tucker handled that already. Just let him in. You'll get him back when you leave. That way. Do whatever you need to do, just don't. Do that. Word on the street is Ravens in town. So ever okay. So they start talking here. It's just you and me. What are the odds? What's that drunk look? The guy? Tucker to lock me and Kent up. It's so obvious. He wants to make sure he's the only I'm so candidate. confused. Damn, you're telling me that drunk was an underboss? He took a bullet for the boss. That's how he lost his leg. There is something else. I just heard from Martin that it's highly likely Raven's about to resurface. Raven? Get out of here. If Martin said so, there's got to be some truth behind it. You've heard of Raven too? Only rumors. Word on the street is Raven kills anyone who gets a look at his face. Once he's made enough money, he runs off and gets himself a new identity. 
No one even knows what he looks like. Holy shit! That's cold, man. Don't yeah, what about these guys? I guess we'll see. Okay, you head up there with Doug. I'll put together a squad to back you up. A lot of private conversations chance. going on We're here. Still breathing. Well, there was already three sheets to the wind. Saw an opportunity, so I had him booked for public intoxication. No shit. Huh. Why'd Kent get there so early? You think the boss told him before the rest of us? I didn't see anyone else there. What's your boss look like? <laughs> nice try. Only us three have ever seen our boss. In the oh! He likes to keep oh! Low okay, 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 okay. Kent I wasn't trying to trick brought the bomb curious, because when Dwight was yeah, trying to call him, wrong. it rang Kent's I've seen Kent drink thing. For years, yet That's I've why drunk. Not even once. when Fair. it pulls up... Boss. Yeah, yeah, don't push it. Drunk or not, you still hit. It blows up on Kent. How are you here? Right? Okay. So Kent brought the bomb. Let's say Kent brought the bomb because that would make sense. Ah! Okay, got it, 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 got it. Okay, that makes sense. All right. Wow, that one was difficult. Okay, next one. I went to the Mountain Hotel earlier to case the place and found Kent in a VIP room. Sucker was already three sheets to the wind. So that means the phone, the phone that Kent had was the bomb. I've seen Kent drink for years, and I've never seen him drunk. Oh, murder his guys, and scum the ship with a remotely detonated explosive. All the info we've gathered on him suggests he eventually kills anyone who sees So that face. means that, okay, Kint's oh, leg. Sorry about that. Kint's leg was uh, the bomb. Oh, wait, I missed that part. I missed that part where Dwight said that. I see. What the heck? Does it strike you as odd that these situations seem to be full of coincidences? Full of coincidences. Yeah, they are. Sorry. I meant great job. You're progressing through these examples at a steady pace, but I knew you could crack them. Yeah, right, I cracked them. On to the next one. <laughs> Tell me, detective. Do you enjoy the theater? Do I enjoy the theater? Okay, let's see. Theater. Theater. Movie theater. Okay. Oh, God. Okay. Who organized Emily's murder? Who sent the ghost text? Who followed the ghost text instructions to kill Sash? Okay. Let's find the room with the most people. No one in this hallway. One room. One room. One room. One person. One bathroom. Kitchen. Three people here. Let's. Okay, let's. Oh, yeah. Maybe there's more people in here. No. Main hall. Th four people. Okay, let's. Okay, let's see this. Let's see this. Sasha will be joining tonight's performance, which means there's going to be a lot of press. Hmm. So, since we've got some time, why don't we rehearse the opening scene one more time? Locking's crucial here. We've got this. Don't worry. Sasha's playing Dorothy today, which means, Ashley, you'll be playing the supporting roles. Really? That's Ashley. I knew this would happen. Well, whatever. All right. Four eyes, you play Dorothy for now. Just follow the marks on the stage. Got it. That's four okay. eyes. Okay, which stand on the mark? Yes, much better. Which start walking? Tech, are you ready? Okay, press the button, four eyes. Make sure the house lands right in front of the witch. 
Okay, the witch screams. Now, she's dead. Release the dry ice, and the witch leave the stage from the back. Dorothy, you're on. Walk to the center of the stage. Okay. Good job, guys. Great job. Looking good. Send the house back up, Four Eyes. And while you're at it, check that rope, will you? Will do. Who's this? Got a minute, Four Eyes? What is it? You've been working in this theater for quite some time, yeah? So you knew Emily, the actress who played Dorothy before Sasha? You wouldn't happen to know if... Sasha had anything to do with her death, would you? So then, you heard the rumors too. Sasha took Emily's place right after she died, and just like that, her career took off. I mean, it's hard not to suspect her. Uh, you can believe what you want, but there's no evidence. There's no use in going around pointing fingers. I guess... I Hi, Weebo! I mean, how did the house suddenly just... Fall on her. Okay, I need to figure out who's who. I want to. I really want to figure out who's who first. So let's go. This room has three people. Let's see if they're talking to each other. And just remember, this deal never happened. You go around blabbing about this, and you'll live to regret it. Mark my words. Oh, I see. I see you're still as vengeful as you were two years ago. And no more of those texts either. Those about drove me crazy. What texts? Oh, stop. Okay, hold on. Let's go into this room where there are two people. By your return to this yeah, who's who? Seems like your old castmates were just as surprised as the trade papers by your return to this stage. <laughs> I've got to thank you for that, Harvey. Saw the That's articles. Harvey. Broadway star Sasha returns to independent theater for limited run. This is Sasha. Talk about publicity. Even I wanted to believe that fairy tale you fed the press. Well, the people are buying it for now. Still a lot of work to do, you know. And a lot of reporters outside. In any case. Looks evil? Do I look evil? I'm just trying to match the vibe of dark, dark and gloomy and broody. Back. Otherwise, we'll have a PR disaster on our hands. Don't worry. I did this show for years, remember? I didn't get this big by doing nothing. Sasha. That, I... That's Sasha. Both the people in here. Tomorrow's the anniversary of Emily's death. Have you gotten any messages from her? You mean those ghost texts? You guys got them too? We sure did. A few days ago, I got a text saying, Killers will be killed. And guess what? Sasha came back today. I figure Emily wants us to avenge her. What the hell? Don't tell me you're taking that text seriously. You two are one can short of a six pack. Oh, well, whatever. Go on with your revenge fantasy then. But leave me out of it. No can do. We need your help. You need to cut the rope so the house lands on Sasha. Oh. Kill her the same way she killed Emily? Name your price. You two are crazy. I ain't no murderer, and I can't be bought either. Not a murderer, huh? Then tell us! Who cut the rope back then and killed Jesus, Emily? Jesus, calm down! What the hell's gotten into you, huh? It was an accident. Even the police said so. An accident? Or maybe Wait, who's who? Enough to cover what? Your tracks. Why are there no names? Some sort of master assassin? I just work the boards and the flies. This is what we're willing to pay you. More than generous, don't you agree? Just tell us, are you in or out? Don't wave that cash in my face. It would take more than money to get me in your plan. Say I agree. I cut the rope and down comes the house on the wrong actress. Or did you forget Ashley is playing the witch tonight? So now you gotta get her and Sasha to switch roles and good luck convincing hottie Miss Hollywood to do that. Are you starting to understand? One dirty deed won't do the trick. There was a lot going on that night. Emily's throat closing up on account of a bad cup of joe. 
the rope that the forensic examiner said was too old, and then Emily walking onto the exact spot where the house was going to fall, and she walked there on her own. That's why her death's still a mystery today. Ah. The rope might be a link, but you boys are missing the rest of the chain. <laughs> you think I care about any of that? All I want is Sasha dead. She murdered Emily. So, can you kill her or not, huh? If you make it happen, the money's yours. You ain't even listening to me. I'd quit while you're ahead, boys. No way you can pull off something like that. Especially not without an inkling of a plan. If I help you, I might as well turn myself in right now. So stop wasting my time. Out! Out! <laughs> What do we do now? Without Jeff, we can't. Mm -hmm. I was if that guy's name is Jeff, okay. Help us. Would have been easier that way. Though he was right that getting rid of Sasha ain't gonna be a walk in the park. Still, she's got to pay. It's so hard. To Emily. Time to call in the big guns. I mean, yeah. <laughs> Killers will be killed. You sure that's Emily telling us to avenge her? Who else would it be? The killer's part is telling us she was murdered, so it wasn't some kind of accident. The will be killed part's telling us to kill that bitch who killed her. Oh my god. Yes, that makes sense. But what about Slim? You think he got those same texts? Slim? When he ain't dancing around in his scarecrow getup, he doesn't give a shit about anything. Unless it's good for him. Hey, where are, the, who are they? I've got the most brilliant idea. <laughs> wow, what's got you all? Hey, hold on. Let's let's see what they say. Oh shit! I didn't mean to. Oops. Oops. Hold on. What? Where was I? Over here. Over here. A little more. Okay. Right but here. Helen, I've got the most brilliant Helen. idea. Helen. This one's Helen. <laughs> Wow, what's got you all in a tizzy, girl? The idea of a life. And then who's this? I'm trying to figure out who this Emily's person name. is. Look for yourself. You'll pay with your life the next time you return to the stage. Come on in. Slim? <laughs> Slim. Surprised? Sasha, let me handle this. You keep hinting you have something. So let's see it. Well, allow me to introduce you. And then who's... you put on a good enough performance. Someone's bound to see it. Yeah, if they could even see me with Sasha out there. Let's see. Listen, Sasha was once in your shoes, you know. Who is this guy? And after Emily's accident, she got her big break. All I'm saying is, you just be ready for anything. If it ends up Sasha can't perform on a certain night. You need to be there to fill in. Oh, is this one of your plans then? Plan? What are you talking about? I just want you to be prepared is all. As for me, I hope that Sasha will be able to perform all three days. All right, all right. I just got a bit carried away. Speaking of Emily's accident though, have you heard about the ghost texts? Yeah, a lot of people saying they're getting texts from Emily. You get any, Larry? All that is That's is Larry. Nonsense. Yeah. But now we gotta figure out who these guys are. No, anyone here? Okay. Help you. I might as well Maybe in their mind. conversation when they talk to each other. Gary. Don't worry. I'll handle everything. Paul? Who's Paul? Let's see. Oh, oh. Is there another name here? Yeah, that's one person. That's four eyes. Who's Paul? Which one's Paul? Okay. It's a go. Once you come in, I'm in the first room on the left. 
That's all taken care of. They'll be here any minute. I, uh, gotta take a leak. Now? For God's sake, you can't piss now! <laughs> Alright, who's this guy? You're shaking pretty bad, Leo. You alright? Me? I, uh... Leo. Oh, That's Leo. I'm fine. Just... Up in there? Which means this guy is Blake. Okay, and then let's see what's going on here. Talk. I gotta check in with the other actors. Okay, let's listen to Four you, Eyes. Sasha. Heard you was gonna come back, but what you doing down here? Figured you'd be up on stage getting ready. I have a favor to ask. Whoa, whoa, whoa. No siree. Not again, Sash. It'll be easy. Just do it the same way as you did last time. Not with Tamara being the anniversary of you know what. You can't keep pulling these stunts. Give my old heart a break. Oh, stop it. You were well paid. Though now that you mention it, what did you do with that old rope? Threw it in the trash, of course. Why? What's it to you? <gasps> so Jeff was the one who killed that must Emily. That the person who just blackmailed me found it. What? That's impossible. <sighs> Calm down. I took care of it. Cost me a fortune, though. Cleaning up your mess. What do you say? Sasha, again, organized. If someone really found it, that's who's Sidom. Oh, there's another person named Sidom. Relax, will ya? No one suspected you last time. Four Eyes got all the heat. Yeah, but while everyone was suspecting Four Eyes, he was suspecting me. That quiet creep was obsessed with Emily. Started poking into things after you left. Uh uh. Even if you were willing to pay me again, the only place I'd have to spend it is the prison commissary. <sighs> that won't happen, I promise. Yeah, this might not be Blake. Why? Because you'll be dropping the house on me this time. Uh, on you? That's exactly right. Even you know I don't want to commit suicide, right? You just cut the rope. And after Four Eyes presses the button to drop <laughs> the house, I'm going to pretend it hits my feet. Your feet? What exactly are you trying to pull, Sash? That doesn't concern you. Just do what I'm asking, all right? Then we're finished. And you can pretend this never happened. Well, uh, all right. There, it's done. You want me to change the marks on the stage, too? <sighs> what kind of stupid question is that? I don't want to get injured for real. Leave the marks right where they are. Otherwise, that thing might actually fall on me. Understood? <laughs> oh, Good. God. I'm going to go get ready. She's going to be destroyed. Is that... Okay. These costumes you just gave us? Uh, right. Okay, these guys are walk in. Okay, hold on. Paul, the target Sasha. She'll be found... Uh, you're sure none of this will be traced back to us? Those two are pros. You've got nothing to worry about. Come on in. Here's the down payment, Paul. Your target's Sasha. I'll take the money, but this guy is Paul. The target Sasha. She'll be found dead on That's stage Paul. tonight. Time of death will be 8.15 p.m. Unless the original plan changes, you don't have to repeat it. Uh, no changes. No, no changes. In our disguises. Are they ready? Two costumes, the cowardly lion. Game is unheard. It is a crime game. You'll be able to walk around backstage. <laughs> no one will suspect a thing. Mm -hmm. Okay, so they're gonna kill Sasha. These two. Sasha's here talking to Jeff. Just remember not to talk to anyone. Just remember not to talk to anyone. Thank you, Evo. I am. Thank you. Just like Leo. We're pros. We can act better than you when we have to. Just one more thing. Us too. We're not going to become suspects, right? Good thinking. So, what's your alibi? Alibi? The police are going to ask about your whereabouts later. What are you going to say, huh, Leo? What? I, uh, I don't... I guess this guy's Sidon, right? He has to be. I don't know if this guy's Blake, yeah. though. 
happens every time. Our alibi. Mm, how about we were on stage? Ugh. In these costumes you just gave us? Uh, right. Uh, we could report him stolen. Ah, tell you what, we'll provide you guys with an alibi, free of charge. Oh. Hit. Uh, Watch uh, it. Uh. And they're out. Nighty night, boys. <laughs> wow. Okay. Amateurs, all of them. Have no idea what they're getting into. Well, the customer is always right. We only did this to make sure we get the rest of our payment. Anyway, let's drag him to the storeroom and tie him up. When the police arrive, they'll just add him to the pile of victims. No harm, no foul. I'll carry him. You make sure the hallway's clear. Got it. He has a seat on. All clear. Let's go. Who is it? Huh? Huh. Chrome Dome. Leo. Hey, guys. Uh -huh. The show Chrome Dome, Leo. Yeah. Start. What are you still doing here? I could ask the same of you two. Hey, uh, who are you carting along, huh? Wait. Chrome Dome. Leo. What the hell is going on here? Nice stash of cash you got there, huh? I get a piece it's that right. That guy's Chrome Dome, which is I, the other guy is um, Blake. No. Clean up the mess. Take a look at all this cash. Forget about Dorothy and her little dog. Oh, don't worry. We'll take the money. But we're not leaving here while that actress is still alive. We've got a reputation to keep up. Sounds good. Let's go find our target. And close the Oh my door. god, these Got are it. like assassins or something. Holy shit. Sasha's I figured it. Of course she is. The M what? What the fuck? Oh my god, guys! Are are you okay? Who could have done this? Harvey! Wake up! Harvey! What's going on? Why is the back door locked? Larry! Larry! Something terrible's happened! What? Oh, there, Sasha. Calm down. What happened? It's Harvey and Slim and, and Chrome Dome and Leo. They... Somebody's knocked them out. I... I... I don't even know if they're still alive! What? Wow. That's impossible. I just saw them earlier at the rehearsal. They're in the storeroom. Follow me. The storeroom? That's where Slim goes to get high. He thinks the straw in his costume masks the smell. Anyway, it's almost showtime. You and Ashley get ready to go out. I'll send four to check. There's no way I'm going back on stage now. I want to get out of here, but I can't because someone locked the back door. Perhaps it is too dangerous for Sasha. Maybe I can... <gasps> Uh, is Sasha there? Who's asking? And what do you want with her? It's me, Leo. Just need to talk to Sasha for a sec. He's lying. I just saw Leo unconscious in the storeroom. I don't know who that man is or what he wants. Sasha isn't here right now. A and you're not in the first scene either, so head backstage. We've already got enough going on here. <laughs> what should I do? Ball. We do it anyway? No. What you can do, use Larry? the side door on the stage. You can play the witch in the first scene. Then, when the smoke appears, you can use it as cover and leave from the side. And as for Dorothy... Yeah, okay, Ashley, good night, Weebo. Take care, Ashley, well. Uh, all right. If you're sure. Of course. Quick, let's switch our costumes. Give us a hand, Helen, would you? Right, I'm on it. Hurry. The role of the witch is simple. Just follow the marks on the stage. Didn't I tell you two to get lost? What are you doing back here? And in costume to boot? We got something to show you, is all. Yeah? Why all the mystery? <laughs> <laughs> oh, God, they're being everybody up. Taken care of. I'll keep an eye on Dorothy from here. You tie him up and lock the door. Got it. A fool's hope. In awe. On stage. Magic means power. And I, Eleonora, the witch of the East, possess that power. You shall all bow before me. There shall be no hope. 
There shall be no miracles. On my mark. Now. <laughs> what? What? She's dead. It, it killed her. We must text her. Are you? What happened? Oh my god. Wait. Okay. So she ends up. Oh, damn. Okay. Tomorrow. Keep an eye. Oh. Control. Oh. No. Oh. I didn't do squat. Squat. Someone. What the? It the killed house. her. It fell on top what of What do you do, Paul? I didn't do squat. All right, hold on. Now we got okay. Who organized Emily's murder? Was Sasha? Who sent all the ghost texts? And who followed the ghost text instruction to kill Sasha? It was gonna be Leon Chrome Dome, who followed the ghost text. I I think we'll blame Chrome Dome. Um, who sent? We now we gotta figure out who sent it. I want to say Four Eyes. Let's follow Four Eyes really quickly. Here. Yeah. You heard the rumors too. Sasha took Emily's place. You might have. Want, but there's no evidence. There's no use in going around pointing fingers. I guess I just don't get it. I mean, how did the house suddenly just fall on her? Who was holding the remote when it happened? I, uh, I was. Oh? Don't tell me that you might have. Of course not. And it's not like I wasn't a suspect as well. But there's no way I could have done it. The remote only controls the hook on the rope. If the rope breaks, well, no remote control or hook can stop that. The rope broke before I even pressed the button. That was confirmed by the police. Yeah, let's skip forward a little oh, more I... and see who he talks to. He goes to talk to Jeff later. I know, I remember that. Any orders from our dear director, Four Eyes? Just wants you to double check all the props. Why, Larry doesn't think I can do my job? Or maybe you don't. Neither of us think that. We both trust. Yeah. Okay, no worries, Seagull. Thank you for being here. Take care. Sasha? Oh, hey, Four Eyes. Just wanted to come say hi to Jeff. Sounds good. I'll let you two talk. I gotta check in with the other actors. Where does Four Eyes go? Let's see. Anyone there? Jeff? Sasha? Sasha, right? Eyes, huh? come. Hey, four eyes. Huh? Come in here for a sec, will you? I want to ask you. Something. It was short. I'm yeah. glad you enjoyed. All right, it was short. Right. Wait, was it? What are you? Is it a good it thing that it was short? At least it was over with quickly. Morning. Welcome back, Nanhua. In this tiny little theater. Not sure. Article I read says she misses us. Something about never forgetting her roots. <laughs> ha ha! How touching. Seriously though. What do you think? You believe that? How in the world am I supposed to know? And the Dorothy before her. Who's he on the phone with? Larry. Never mind that. How are You're looking a bit under the weather. Everything all right? I I'm fine. I'm fine. Who is that? Old friend of mine. Never mind that. How are the actors? They ready? Emily's texts have been making everyone nervous, especially with Sasha back. But overall, things seem okay. All right. Do me a favor and ask others to wait a little longer. I need to check the blocking marks one last- Okay, let's let Slim and Harvey talk for a second. Damn! 
Then, then all this was Emily's idea? Besides, this ain't even my phone number. Here. Okay, let's see this. Let's, let's see what, what goes on here. But what was that text about, huh? Oh, okay, we're gonna find out. We're about to find out. We were pretty convincing back there, huh? Now where's my cut? Mm -hmm. <sighs> there you go. Gotta hand it to you, man. Must have been tough getting Miss Big Star back here. Uh, don't flatter me. But what was that text about, huh? You don't trust me? Had to hear Sasha in my conversation for yourself. So you make me call you behind her back. That's a good way of getting caught. Also, that's a bit paranoid, even for you. How's the investigation going? Whatever. I'm very confused, but I think we're figuring it out. So we'll be fine. Wait, what? Text? Call? I didn't know such thing. This whole thing too much for you, big guy? Rattling a few brain cells, huh? You sent me a text telling me to call you, you ignoramus. Look, right here. Call me. Don't let Sasha know. Gotta hear what she wants to do next, huh? What the hell? Let me see that. And see? The text before that, telling me to get her to fake an injury. And before that, telling me to convince her to come back to the theater. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Why, why would I care about any of that? I'm only in this for the money. Doesn't matter to me if she's injured or not, or even if she performs tonight. Besides, this ain't even my phone number. Wait. If these aren't from you, then... Who the hell are they from? Wait a minute. Hold it. I remember this number. Y it ain't yours. All the texts I've been getting were from this number, too. What? Let me see your phone. Here, see for yourself. And check out all those texts you sent me. Well, I'll be damned. Then whoever this person is, they've been contacting both of us. God damn it. Let me check something. Uh, that old contact book should still be in this room somewhere. E, E, Emily, Emily. There she is. 917-633. Fuck me. That's Emily's number. God damn. Then, then all this was Emily's idea? And the rope I got? And our meeting today? Oh, this is starting to creep me out. Wait, really think it's Emily's ghost, do you? Nah, fuck it. I'm, I'm, I'm calling this number. Let's see who answers. Okay, whose phone Door gets rang? Nothing else to double check? I've been waiting right outside this movie. Oh, there's some. Okay, if they call that number. Something just occurred to me, Larry. Wasn't it Emily that always played the leading roles? Huh? Who is it? Huh? Get me out. Wait. You don't really think it's Emily's ghost, do you? If they call a number, whose phone Fuck. rings? I'm, I'm, I'm calling this number. Let's see who... Wasn't it Emily that always played the leading roles? Not I them. Mean, back before she died? Chrome dome. No. Oh, no, their phones are ringing. Right there? You ain't normally one to go around forgetting stuff. Jeez, Sasha's back for a few days and suddenly you're acting all weird. I'm hardly the only one who's acting weird, wouldn't you say? What do you mean by that? Never mind. Found it. I'll leave you be now. Huh. <laughs> Seems like, <laughs> what are the odds? Makes you wonder who got her cop. Hey, Four Eyes, you seen that manager of mine? Harvey. As I recall, he went into the storeroom earlier. Got it. Thanks. What do they talk about here? Oh my gosh, that's the same thing all those ghost texts were saying. <sighs> who was in here earlier? I've been waiting. Let's see what they sit talk about. Can't believe it. Would it be rude to ask for your autograph? When's your movie start shooting? And is it true your first on-screen role is some big bad villain? Why don't we continue this conversation while you do my makeup? Have a seat. 
Now what were you asking about my new movie? Oh, there's something on my mirror. Killers will be killed, Emily. Oh my gosh. Wait, who it's went in here earlier? All those ghost texts were saying. Yeah. Okay, so no one, let's don't go in here earlier. What's, what do you want now? What? More bad news? I just contract. You're in your world. Oh! She wrote that there. She wrote on the mirror. Oh! Wait, Helen! Oh god, that... That is a gross sound. Asha? Is that... It would help you graphic. Whoever's pretending to be... Hey, let's follow her. Let's follow Helen everywhere. Let's see where Helen goes. Where is she right now? She's in here. Pretty choked up anytime someone mentioned her name. If they really think she's... Helen! Helen! I've got the most brilliant... Kissy girl! Sure it would. But... I just never thing thing. This is so interesting. Okay. Sasha? You in there? Do this message and make their There's no way you can perform after this, Sasha. Look closer, you little fool. It's not blood, it's lipstick. Now I'm certain whoever's behind this must be here in the theater. I'm going to catch them and make their life miserable. Wait here. I need to go look for someone. Look for someone? Manager of Hang on. But they didn't work like we hoped. Larry, something to bomb throat. Best luck in the world. Durations. Sasha might be your Oh! Larry! Makes you wonder who got her coffee that day. Doesn't it? <laughs> Ashley. Sasha might be your oh, be your just Ashley. Sasha might be your Oh! Larry! Helen? Oh, I better get on stage. Have you, uh, taken care of it? The, uh, new alterations? I sewed on the applique, but they didn't work like we hoped. Larry! Oh, okay, so did Ashley and Helen talk about something when they're in this room? Let's hear this. up that whole house, huh? Hey, what do you think you're doing in here? Oh, cool your jets. It's faster to get to the dressing room through here. Faster until you break your leg on something. All right, all right. Duly noted, Mr. Fun Killer. One quick question, though, just because I'm curious. This rope, what happens when it gets old, huh? Will it break? Break? Did someone tell you to come asking me questions? Heavens to Murgatroyd, it was just a question. Whatever. Have fun. Huh. Got the most brilliant idea. Wow. What's got you all in a tizzy, girl? The idea of a lifetime. This is going to be a golden opportunity for me. But I okay. need your help. I'm listening. I was just talking to Larry, and he reminded me of something. If there's going to be as much press here as he says, I need to play Dorothy. Even just once. It's guaranteed to get my name out there. Sure it would. But there's no way in hell Sasha will agree to that. Well, sure. Not willingly, but what if something were to, you know, happen? And she wouldn't be able to play Dorothy. And just what are you thinking, huh? You pull something like that, and Sasha will eat you alive. 
Oh, I'm not gonna hurt her or anything. Just who do you think I am? I'm thinking something more along the lines of those ghost texts from Emily. You mean that actress who died on stage, right? A couple different people have said they've gotten texts from her now. Pretty creepy, if you ask me. I'm yeah. so confused. It was Sasha who had Emily killed, which is how Sasha became the leading actress. I was just talking to Four Eyes about that. I am no so that confused. Stay in the flames, so to speak. I don't need any proof. All I'm thinking is, what if I use the whole ghost texting thing to scare Sasha a little? It's not worth a chance. That's actually not a half bad plan. <laughs> Surprise me if so. Does Four Eyes do anything here? I'm here. I'm here. I'm around spreading rumors. Anyway, I should get back to work. You too. Start getting ready for the show. Never mind that. How are the actors? They ready? Okay, see you, Sin. Thank you for being here. Everyone nervous, especially with Sasha back. But overall, things seem okay. I'm so confused by this scene. Of us to wait a little longer. I need to check the blocking marks one last time. As soon as that's done, we'll get started. We'll do. Wait. Where does he go? Go back here. You again? What? Something else to double check? Nah, I think I left my phone here. Your phone? Everything all right there? You ain't normally one to go around forgetting stuff. Jeez, Sasha's back for a few days. Wouldn't you say? Wouldn't you say? Yes, weird. Wouldn't you say? I'm hardly the only one who's acting weird. Would say? What that? Never mind. Found it. I'll leave you. Okay. Four Eyes has been sending the ghost text. Steve Dome has been the one following. Okay, okay, let's do this. Sasha organized Emily's murder. Four Eyes sent the ghost text. And then C Dome has been following them. Right? Ooh. Okay. We're wrong. We're wrong. Maybe who followed the ghost text instructions to kill Sasha? Maybe it's saying Paul? Hi, Abby. Welcome in. No, not Paul. Do we have to choose Leo? Is it Leo? Okay. Um. Yeah, let's start from this conversation in the beginning. Tomorrow's the anniversary of Emily's death. Have you gotten any messages from her? You mean those ghost texts? You're visionary? You okay, okay. We're almost done stream, I think. Because I do want to get something to eat before I hop in for Naomi's birthday celebrations. So. Uh. And guess what? Sasha came back today. I figure Emily wants us to avenge her. What the hell? Don't tell me you're taking that text seriously. You two It's Seedom, right? Seedom's the one back. who followed the ah, ghost whatever. text and tried to kill Sasha. Unless fantasy, then. But leave me out of Which start walking. I'm so confused. Okay, press the button for eyes. Hey, let's look at look at the end here. Does Helen say anything until at the end? We're on, Four Eyes. Raise the... Magic means strength. Magic means power. We say Jeff? I don't know. Okay. Okay, we gotta follow Larry then. There's some extra stuff about Larry earlier on. Carried away. Some revenge. When he's alone. We gotta listen to Larry when he's alone and see what's going on here. Hello? Who is it? 
Is anyone there? Jeff? Sasha? Is he just on his phone call the entire time and he doesn't say anything at all? So confused. Good under the weather. How are the actors? They ready? Okay, does Jeff get more? Does Jeff get more things? Hold on. Jess is here the entire time, right? He doesn't really talk to anybody while he's here. Alone. Hey, let's listen to Slim real quickly here. Pinning you have something, so let's see it. Well, allow me to introduce you to this rope. Let me guess. You're gonna try to hang us with that frayed piece of junk. Oh, you're right about that. See this cut here? Who did that, I wonder? <laughs> what do you think the police would say if they got their hands on this? Huh? I don't have time for this. Just pay him. You got your cash. Give it here. And just remember, this deal never happened. You go around blabbing about this, and you'll live to regret it. Mark my words. Oh, I see. I see you're still as vengeful as you were two years ago. And no more of those texts, either. Those about drove me crazy. What texts? Oh, stop playing dumb. You sent me texts in Emily's name. You can return to the stage. Emily. Emily. Life, the next time you return to the stage, you'll pay with your life the next time you return to the stage. <laughs> oh my. <laughs> That's too hilarious. What? Are you being haunted now? Oh, shut it! Did you send this or not? As if. Look. That ain't even my phone. Wait, so who followed the... I'm so confused. That's all that matters. Let's just get out of here. Or maybe... Break a leg. Nice seeing you. Break a leg. Or maybe something else. Or maybe something else. Is it Slim? Was Slim the one who followed the instructions? I'm so confused. It feels so wrong to fall people into the toilet. Oh, I'm, I'm fine. Is Jeff here? Who is it? Who'd be calling me now? Wait, who's calling him now then? Okay, who's ringing for him? Nobody. No one. No one's ringing for him right now. Unless it's Jeff. No, it's not Jeff. Zidong? No. Real. What if that really? Joy, not a half bad plan. Wait, who's gonna be calling him? This time. Not with tomorrow. Nobody's calling him. That doesn't make sense. Unless it's like. I don't know. Who followed the ghost text instructions to kill Sasha? There's only C Dome or Leo. And we answered we both. Unless it unless we're saying like Paul or uh sorry, not C Dome. Paul or wait, what's the other guy's name? The two guys that come in? Two. Blake. Start getting ready for the show. Yeah, let's do Blake. Does it count as Blake? If we say Blake? No. Huh? I'm so confused. 
seems like your old castmates were just as surprised as the trade papers by your return to this stage. What do you want now? What? More bad news? No. It, it... Yeah, we know Four Eyes is the one sending the text because he's the one doing it. Here. Right, he's getting he's sending messages. For the money, not to torment you. Then whoever it was is still out there? I'm afraid so. With the Halcyon Theater Company and everything. If I don't show up What does Slim do by himself here? Larry's also by himself. I'm so confused. Why is Why is literally just by himself doing nothing the entire time? Just wants you to double check all the props. What? Well, all the ghost text instructions to kill Sasha. Ah, I guess we just have to go through Slim? No. There's process of elimination at this point, right? Do we say four eyes? I don't know. Hi Malami san, welcome back in. We're just guessing now. I know it doesn't make sense. I've tried everyone that makes sense. So I'm I Larry. Larry because he's getting the phone calls. What? No, that doesn't make sense. That makes no sense. He didn't do anything. Jeff was the one who cut the rope. Stadon was the one who was reacting to the text. I don't want... Oh, hold on. Okay, we're going to follow Larry the entire time now. This makes no sense. What the frick? I'm angry. Sasha will be joining tonight. Why don't we rehearse the Rolls aren't that bad. You get to I'm down to one word. Which? Ashley, look on the back together with one of Hollywood's Pies up there. Listen. <laughs> Larry's had no conversations about anything. All three days. All right, all right. I just got a bit carried away. Yes, I, I don't have. get it. This makes no sense. I'm angry. That's hogwash. Sure, sure, Sasha might have benefited the most from Emily's death, but that doesn't mean she killed her. Even the. That's what. Uh, sorry, I just needed to blow off some steam. Them suffer. That's what. Wait, okay, hold on, hold on, hold on. This might be something. Emily did murder her. I'd be first in line to see them suffer. That's what. Uh, sorry, I just needed to blow off some steam. It's hard to pretend I don't miss our late leading lady. But the show must go on. So go get ready for tonight. Focus. I gotcha, I gotcha. I'm off to make up. How was he? How did he follow any instructions at all? Hello? Anyone there? I don't get it. He's literally sitting here the entire time, listening to a phone call. Like he's did. He did nothing. What instructions did he follow? Oh, wait. Oh, he moved. Wait. Oh, he moved the marking? Something just occurred to me, Larry. Wasn't it Emily that always played the leading roles? I mean, doing playing the witch. We're a small theater company, but we were even smaller back then. We only had two female actresses, so Emily would play the leading roles, which in this case was Dorothy, and Sasha had to cover all the other female roles. That day, though, Emily had an allergic reaction, accidentally had a sip of some hazelnut coffee, and damn near threw her voice out, and a bum throat. 
So she and Sasha. Oh, that okay. But I don't. There's like, there's like no like, there's like nothing. Oh, I hate this one was annoying. This one was really annoying. This one was really annoying. I'll be honest. <laughs> there was nothing to indicate anything at all. Oh my god. Is that just normal to know? I don't think he. Okay, let's just see. See this cut here? Who did that? I wonder. Yeah, but what if someone really did murder her? I'd be first in line to see them so that's what. You'd be calling me now. Emily's number. Hello? Who is it? Is anyone there? Jeff? Sasha? Check the blocking box one last time. As soon as that's done, we'll get started. Any orders from our dear director, Four Eyes? Just wants you to double check all the props. Huh? Who'd be calling me now? Emily's number. Fuck it. I'm, I'm, I'm calling this number. Let's see who answers. Is he? You? Why? Something else to double check? Nah, I think I left my phone here. Your phone? Everything alright there? You ain't normally one to go around forgetting stuff. I didn't like that one. That one was dumb. That made no sense. That one made no sense. Then someone used the director to commit the murder. Congratulations, Detective. Oh. You've passed the test. I've passed the test. Unfortunately, there's no time to celebrate. The real work is about to begin. The real work. Okay. Oh my god. Okay. That was actually a pretty fun game. But I think we're going to call it here, guys. It's a test? I guess it was a test. I'm going to get something to eat. Is Naomi alive yet? Let me check really quickly. Hold on. Give me just a second. Ba, 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 ba. Okay, okay, okay. All right, guys. I'm going to send you guys over to Naomi. We're going to be on her stream later on for some birthday stuff. I'm going to get something to eat, but... This is a fun game. Thank you guys so much for being part of the stream. Ready, eat well, sleep well, stay hydrated, have a zootastic night, morning, afternoon, evening, whatever it might be for you guys. I'll catch you guys later for Hunk Guy Star Rail, and I'll also catch you guys in a little bit at Naomi's birthday, okay? All right, guys, I'll see you later. Bye bye. Bye bye. Bye bye. Just to say you are you, follow me I can hear you screaming, I'm calling
Cupid, but now I'm left to feel. 